Okay, y'all. I know sometimes shit be looking janky as hell, but I just wanted to give you guys a quick message. I need to get out of here, but I just kind of felt called to do this. So you guys may have a new uh, beginning. Something is ending here that was major for you. Life choices, life decisions. This could be um, letting go of uh, people, places, and things. You could be ending, uh, like if you were in school, you could be ending a job on your way to starting something new, a, a new cycle in your life. Even if this is something spiritual, um, there's something that you've been dealing with. And because this is uh, the world card, this major arcana, this is something that you have been uh, dealing with for a bit. And it possibly could have been a cycle that you've been in for a while, but it has come to an end and you're going into a new phase of your life. And there are choices that you have to make here with the lover's card. The lovers can be about relationships, but mostly it's about um, decisions that you uh, are being faced with that you have to make. The cards are flying. Hold on. But it's a major... Where did my card go? It's a major decision um, that you have to make. And this was upside down the nine of swords so there's been a lot of anxiety that you may have been dealing with um and that could be a cycle that is ending for you simply because you are coming out of this this cycle right here now you're having an end to any kind of worry stress and anxiety that you have been dealing with things that really just may have felt like they weren't going um going your way and you could have made a decision with the lover's card. You could have made a decision to possibly have something um, change in your life that allows you to release whatever anxiety that you were going through. Yeah, and now you feel a sense of justice that you're finally getting what it is that you have been desiring for so freaking long. Like... It's, it's your turn. <laughs> you know what I mean? Things are finally starting to go into the right place. And whatever situation you are dealing with, that you're starting to feel as though you're receiving, you're just due, and whoever was involved in the other situation is receiving, they're just due. And now you're feeling a sense of success and victory. This is, you know, it took a lot of work to get here because this is the six of wands, okay? And it's all about action. You've been taking the action that has been needed to bring you to a place where you feel like you have success. And you may still have some people looking at you because we've got you holding the one up here, the one wand, and then the other ones are being held by these five down here. Now, the five of wands, the card that comes before this, is all about having that... um bit of drama and confrontation amongst uh those that are around you like your peers or your friends or something like that um it could even be possibly involving things with work and so those it's like you're up here you you have victory over these individuals or these different situations if you want to look at it like that and you're sitting up top and these individuals are looking at you so there also could be um some form of jealousy and envy going on because uh, the actions of others did not stop you and you were able to still make it, okay? And you were able to move away from the drama. Again, we have um, a situation where this is... The Six of Swords is... is the five of swords before it is dealing with a feeling of defeat, okay? And so you had two cards that were basically saying that the previous card before you had to deal with some kind of aggravating issue. And this is moving clearly moving away from it, okay? Going into a place where you feel more sense of calm. Now you can actually uh, 
listen to your intuition or feel more in tune with your intuition and allowing it to guide you. Okay. Um, you may actually want to get around some water or allow yourself to bathe in the moonlight, possibly looking at, uh, this moon. I can't, not sure if it's a waning moon or waxing, but this is, you know, being in a place where you're actually able to release some things, put some things into motion for yourself and be in touch with your higher, your higher self, because now you're able to actually tune in to You're actually able to tune into that, that, that voice. Sometimes when you're just, you know, in a, in a, a place where you feel like it's just not working for you, it can be a little hard and challenging to get the messages that you really need that can help you. Okay. But there's been some decided, um, decisive action that has been taken and you need to continue to be very stoic. And how you handle things, be very decisive in your uh, actions and what it is that you're doing. Don't allow yourself to go back to a um, old situation that kept you in a place where you were just struggling. You're going to get some really good news um, and things may be happening really fast for you. you. This also could be some improvement when it comes to your work situation. And getting those really good messages coming in about things improving and changing for you. You also could um, be traveling. That could be coming up for you as well. But it just feels like the energy has gotten a lot lighter and a lot better for you. And at the end now, you're going to receive um, the value of everything that you are. Okay, this is also being compensated at work for the effort that you've been putting in and the life that you're trying to have for yourself. So um, I would just say, you know, keep on going. Don't give up and uh, allow the haters to do what they, they do best, which is hate. But you have a lot of good things uh, coming your way. So congratulations to you. And for those that this resonates with, leave a comment below because I'm really curious to uh, know how this has affected you. I got to get myself in the dough and ready for work, y'all. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. And I hope that this fed your spirit. It definitely fed my spirit. And as always... Peace, love, and light.